Oh hi LawyerLawyer.tv viewers Welcome to yet another edition of Lawyer.net Hands-on First Impression And this time we have the brand new Nokia Lumia 1520 As you might know, the Nokia Lumia 1520 is one of the devices that were announced at Nokia World last month it is not only the first tablet in Nokia Lumia family, but also in the whole Windows Phone segment. My first thought when I first saw the device at Nokia World Abu Dhabi is that it is really really huge. As you can see the size differences here between Lumia 1520, Lumia 1020 and Lumia 920. It is still a pretty huge device even when you put next to Samsung Galaxy Note 3. However, even though Note 3 is actually thinner than the Lumia 1520, the round edges of Lumia 1520 made it look otherwise. This particular unit is finished in bright yellow with non-glossy and a smooth surface similar to Lumia 1020, which made it easy to slip into your pocket given that, that your pants are not too tight. The exterior design mirrors the previously released Lumia 925 design with round edges in all directions as opposed to Lumia 920 and 1020 which both have flat top and bottom. As for its internal hardware, the Lumia 1520 is certainly packed with a lot of high-end goodies. Here is the list. With the exception of Lumia 1520's camera, which is slightly smaller than Lumia 1020 at 20 megapixels. Nevertheless, the Lumia 1520 pure view camera still retains the dual capture ability, oversampling, and optical image stabilization from Lumia 1020. Furthermore, the Nokia Rich recording technology in Lumia 1520 is actually slightly more advanced than the one in Lumia 1020 because it utilizes four microphones which give it directional stereo recording ability. Not to forget, the Lumia 1520 also comes with a 1.2 megapixels front facing camera. Meanwhile, the Nokia Lumia 1520 is also the first device to feature the new Lumia Black update, which is a combination of Windows Phone's GDR3 update and Nokia's own tweaks as well as in house apps. Among the new ability that the update offers in Lumia 1520 is the driving mode which allows users to set the phone to ignore incoming phone calls or messages and automatically send a custom text message to the caller or sender. The Lumia Black Update also offers the ability to close apps right on the multitasking screen. Yes, finally! As for in-house app, there is the new Nokia Storyteller, which is an alternative to the native photo and video album in Windows Phone. It uses timeline and location to display them instead, which, in my opinion, made it slightly easier to navigate around your photos and album in general. Another in-house app that the Lumia Black Update has enabled for the new Lumia 1520 is the Nokia Beamer. It allows users to let anyone remotely view what's on their Lumia 1520 screen through a web browser. As far as first impression goes, I have to repeat this again. The Lumia 1520 is one gigantic device. That being said, Lumia 1520's sleek and rounded profile made it comfortable to hold, although one hand operation proved to be slightly challenging, even though the keyboard and icons are slightly bigger than other Lumias, since they are scaled according to Lumia 1520's screen size. Nevertheless, the 6-inch Full HD screen on the Lumia 1520 does give you a clearer view not only at videos and images, but also at your apps and games. Alright, so there you have it, a brief hands-on look at the brand new Nokia Lumia 1520. If you like this video, do give us a thumbs up or leave a comment below. Better still, don't forget to subscribe to Lawyer.tv for all the latest information from the world of gadgets and beyond. Thanks for watching and see you soon.